that's in coming off the assist from Jokic. Jokic has got three assists in the game. And from second rounder to MVP grade, Nikola Jokic. What a story. Amazing, Kevin. And you know, one thing that Jokic did to transform his game, dedicate himself to his conditioning. Jokic is in much better shape now than when he first entered the league. Denver calls timeout. And as things present themselves throughout a game, teams have to adapt on the fly. And timeouts are a wonderful opportunity to just settle in and recollect the thoughts of your entire team. Not just the guys playing, but the entire team. Boston making a switch here. Murray's checked in. Kept alive. And the basket by Gordon. Gordon's got nine. Aaron Gordon's athleticism can show up in other areas. That time, track down the offense board. And that was another look at the fantastic mobile one drop that happened a moment ago. And a close game like this, you've got to dig deep and just find a way to make things happen. And he's got his first chance at the line here. Jamal Murray, shooting one. One misses for Murray. And Jamal Murray sort of carrying the flag for Canada and all the great players who have infiltrated the league over the past couple of seasons. He is a bucket getter. And it's Davis missing. And so it's Jokic with the ball. He brings it up for Denver. Their biggest lead of the game was not. And after spending his first seven years in Orlando, Aaron Gordon traded in 2021, going from the Magic, a team out of the playoffs, to a team chasing the title. And with Aaron Gordon leaving Orlando, Greg, how did you think that deal worked out for him? Kevin, I think the change of scenery was great for Gordon, taking on more of a complimentary role and getting more big game experience. And another great look at the 2K drop. That's an incredible move by him on what's been an impressive night all around. And a foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. That's Jokic doing a better ball. job as the years have gone on, just drawing more contact and getting to the line. And that's a good thing. He's an over 80% shooter there. Wow. Well, what, did he have something in his eye on that shot? <laughs> that will be. Seven lead changes now, and we're just in the third quarter. Yeah, frustrating for a coach, but it's great to watch as a fan. Murray outside. Just over two and a half minutes gone by here in the second half. Davis against Jokic. That shot missing. Austin with the ball. It's a one-point game. And the jam by Levine. And when Levine goes up, you have that period where you're wondering what he's going to do. And it's usually something spectacular. Two minutes remaining. Order against Buck. Two minutes. Inside, Murray, and Levine with the block. Right side, Davis. The shot's good on the assist by Butler. And it's a five-point Boston lead. Well, it didn't take long, did it? In his second season, AD showed that ability to be able to completely take over on the offensive end. And we're seeing that here tonight. And he stays with it. Caldwell Pope on the wing. Knocks down the three ball. Caldwell Pope's got his third bucket of the night. Now sometimes there's passes and then there's precision passes. Murray with one of those there. Now a timeout called by Boston. So Denver ends up going with a whole new group. And then for Boston, Brown comes in for Buck. And Luka Doncic subbed in for Jamal Murray. Yes, that goes in. Eight points for Zach Levine. A playmaker of Doncic's talents wasn't missing that gap. He quickly gets the ball to the wide open man. Outside Jackson. Back to Brown. Denver passing it around. Smith finds Jackson. Here's Smith. Six on the shot clock. From the arc. Doesn't go that time. And it's Boston the other way. Here's Doncic, and Doncic throws it down. 
slammed down by Doncic, a monster in the backcourt at 6-7. Here's Smith. Rebound, Boston. Kuzma's got six rebounds here tonight. From the corner, and it's Levine that Zach time Levine. on the assist by Doncic. Levine's got the lead up to eight now for Boston. Smith, the pass to Jackson. Smith's shot is good. A really good job by Reggie Jackson just finding the shooter and feeding him. And really the smart thing would be to hold for the last shot. Every second right now is valuable to you. That should be their strategy. Oh, taking it to the rack with power. Hammering down the two-hand slam. Jackson misses. On the wing, Levine. The dish to Davis. Back to Levine. The three. Off target. And so is Boston. Holding on to an eight-point lead You're heading into the break. And they... The visiting team... And a chance right now to show you our State Farm assist of the game. Yeah, a terrific, unselfish play right here. Set up his teammate. And how about the setup this was? What an advantage if your off guard can make plays so valuable. The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. Gordon steps in at the floor with Jokic in his center. Out on the perimeter, it's Caldwell Pope and Porter Jr. And it's Jackson in at the point. That's the group on the floor for Denver. Full streaking past the defense. Looked like he had another gear he got to. Denver trails by eight. Caldwell Pope outside. And Davis sends it back. They recover it. Here's Butler driving inside. Man, way over the defenses. Jimmy Butler gets some air time. And so it's Jokic with the ball. He brings it up for Denver. Pass to Porter. A three ball. Sinks the three-pointer. And perimeter scoring, I have to imagine it was a topic of discussion at halftime. Maybe trying to find a little bit more space and ball movement to get guys open at the three-point. Uh, he's too good a finisher to blow that kind of chance, but that's going to be a wake-up call to the defense. Denver calls timeout. And hey, what a career call for a pole has had to this one. He's been such a great complimentary guard. He just takes care of the ball. He shoots well all over the floor. He's a three-point threat. He certainly accepts the responsibility and the challenge defensively. He's carved out a career, and it's going to get longer. Murray's checked in for the Nuggets. And then for Boston. Johnson, he's checked in for Kyle Kuzma. And Murray's subbed in for Levine. Right now, let's send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldridge. Hey, guys, will Mike Malone talk to his team during that last time out? He said, if we're going to pull this out, we have to do it as a team. We have to rely on one another, trust one another, and help one another. Let's go get this. Kevin, back to you. Thank you, David. Austin leading by seven. Oh, and here comes Johnson all alone. Knocked loose. Jokic finds Caldwell Pope. Good, and the assist goes to Jokic. Jokic has got five assists tonight. And Jokic, an elite passer for a guy at his position. Pass to Johnson. And the swim to Mike Johnson. You gotta love his aggressiveness to finish inside. Well, his leaping ability gives him a great advantage. Rule with the steal. Out to the right wing. Murray for three. They get it again. Poole the pass to Davis. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. That's his second free throw. It's good. Beyond Jokic. Have we seen Anthony Davis change both his body and his game to adapt over time? to what's going on in today's NBA, becoming a much more effective three-point shooter. For three, Murray. Rebound, Boston. Well, you make strides to get back in the ball game, but an errant shot like that can definitely cost Jordan you Poole. any kind of momentum. Have to use better judgment there. Big miscommunication 
on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. Well, I know they don't have mobile devices out there for texting, so they might as well talk to one another. That's his first and an ball. important part of first every team's team game, a look at the hustle stats for Boston. Their fast break plays have seemed unstoppable. They just keep finding ways to overrun the defense here in transition. And another difference maker that we could point to tonight has been second chance points. They've been in there, they've had active hands, they've been in great position, and they've been smart attacking the offensive glass. Here's what Boston's going with right now. Kyle Kuzma's checked in for Jensen. And Levine subbed in for Jamal Murray. And they get it. It'll go. The Boston Lewis get back down to 10 with the basket from Gordon. And Gordon doing it all here. Fills it up, cleaning the glass. You name it, he's getting it done. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. You gotta love strong defense, especially when it comes in the form of harsh rejection. Wow. And big defensive plays like that will help them stay in control of this one. And here are the Nuggets now. Murray outside. And the pass to Jokic. And there's the block. Just stops it cold and takes possession. That's good from Poole on the assist by Davis. Poole's got 10 points in just the second half. Denver calls timeout. They trail by 12. 129 left in the fourth quarter. And now a moment to present the New Balance player of the game, Anthony Davis. Yeah, and his percentage from the field tonight, just amazing. He hadn't just been gunning. He's been picking his spots. And, and you need that kind of patience and discipline to shoot as well as he had. He silenced this crowd with an unreal display. His ability to drown out the noise and the hostility of an opposing crowd is pretty special. 129 left in the fourth quarter. It's stolen by Davis. Levine against Murray. They get it back. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. That's his Good at getting defenders foul. to compromise on the inside. Kuzma drawing a foul that time. Shooting and a player opt-out for Kyle Kuzma Kyle after Kuzma. this season. G.A. probably hoping to earn himself a raise. Yeah, and he's a worker looking to round out his game and take that next step as he's just entering his prime. And again, Denver no good. That's another just bad decision on a night full of those. His shot selection tonight has been questionable at best. To the inside. Oh, a nice defensive play to disrupt the alley oop. Pass to Poole. And he dunks Jordan it down. Poole. Look, they, they earned this victory Anthony tonight. Davis. Tough to dominate the way they did. Now, these nights last a long time when you just go out there and you outwork your opponent. You know that that's going to pay dividends. Tonight it's going to come a win. In a win. Zach Levine. That's his third personal foul. Second and he knocks down the first one. Jamal Murray more and more has come into his own as a player capable of shouldering the offensive load and being a leader for his team at times. Here's what Boston's going with right now. Clay Thompson is checked in for Kyle Kuzma. Grant comes in for Jimmy Butler. And Monks subbed in for Levine. Finishing strong. This is how you want to close things out. Yeah, definitely putting a stamp on this one. A very, very decisive victory for the club tonight. And the ball's tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. Ball ball. And here are the Nuggets now. And taking care of the ball has been a problem for them. That's something that they've got to fix. While the defense has been good, a lot of these turnovers have been unforced. Clay outworking the defense and letting that one go. Takes the 13-footer. Jordan kicks to Smith. Murray the pass to Green. Knocks it loose. And out of bounds as the Nuggets gain possession. Home team ball. Substitution on the court. Awaiting foul. Nikola Dajic. That's his first personal foul. 13 foul. He misses the free throw. Shooting for your home team. 
Ish Smith at the line. For so two. he comes up empty, missing both. And 